hello friends so in this topic we are just going to configure a network controller that will monitor all your network devices okay so it is a kind of simulator that usually we do in real time like a solar wind or any monitoring tool so it is also a one feature in our packet tracer by which we can do so here is the device network controller just to drag it and uh, um, build any topology that you have in your uh, lab no matter how uh, which kind of topology do you have just connect this controller with your network okay so i'm connecting with the uh, auto cable let's uh, pick it up what's uh, uh, cable it is uh, choosing and uh, i have configured the dhcp server in this router so this uh, controller will get the ip from the dhcp server so just open the control console config and click on dhcp so it will get the ip address from the dhcp uh, firstly um, make this port up so port is up now and uh, it has chosen wrong ip so again just click on dhcp and it picked correct ip address of the range okay now you know your its ip so let me keep the ip address 1.1.6 okay now open any pc in your network and go to the web browser and type the ip address of the controller okay as you see that it's uh, prompted for the username and password so set up your username and password so i'm just giving like a admin password is also admin and confirm password admin okay set up and login with the password username and password that you have given and done so you can see the console of this network controller that uh, you have nothing host and devices in your dashboard so just uh, okay so uh, just go to go to your uh, dashboard and uh, connect so in the dashboard go to this uh, network device and setting and uh, firstly give the credential credential uh, any credential that you have like i'm going to give the abc and uh, password is also abc enable password is abc and description abc okay that's it now go to discovery and type no 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 not discovery just go to device and dev add device ip address of the any network device that you have in your topology that i have a uh, 1.1 1.3 and 1.5 and 1.4 all the IP addresses I have so I can add each so I just want to give first 1.1.1 credential you can choose ABC ABC add okay just go and go to so it has not added device let me give again Yeah, so it's giving like unreachable wrong credential. Why? Uh, because uh, the credential you have provided in the controller that is not matching with the device. So just go to the device and configure the same con uh, same username and password. Config T username ABC and password ABC that's it okay now again go to and just refresh the page 
as you see that uh, update and you see that it's fetched a device type device type is router one and it is uptime 29 minutes and everything each it has fetched from the device and device is currently managed okay you can another device as well another device like uh, i just want to add this, uh, this switch so provide the credential config t username abc password abc okay and go to again your controller and add device and see the device ip address that is 1.1.1.5 1.1.5 and uh, credential abc add so unsupported it's like coming unsupported let's wait for some time okay so this device is unsupported saying unsupported no problem uh, we will add another device another this router 1.1.1.3 and uh, strong credential again so configure the credential Just provide the credential same enable config t username abc password abc okay and now open the controller and refresh the page just go to this and update so you see that it faced the R2 as well and uh, everything is uh, coming out and uh, I just want to update this so it is not supported no problem now you can go to dashboard and in the end dashboard you see that there are four devices and let me add a host host is uh, not here topology topology you see that it is facing the topology r1 and r2 so uh, devices that you configure in your uh, controller you will get the simulation of those uh, devices here and it is getting the topology same topology you can trace the path any path like from any source to destination so source is the ip address of this controller okay and destination any any ip address of the topology and just trash so it will give you the topology like controller and this unknown device and the router unknown devices comes uh, like a pc hub uh, no sorry hub switch like this this devices comes in unknown so it is getting okay so let's go to another thing another feature of this con uh, controller provisioning that or the device discovery internal management everything you are getting that this is the switch multi-layer switch so it is kind of a monitoring tool that you can apply in your packet tracer topology and it is very helpful to uh, helpful for you to simulate your uh, real environment with this uh, network controller so hope it is 
this video gives you uh, helpful information so thank you for watching this video